We were nervous, but we were determined, and nothing was going to stop us from doing it. I'm Gwen Davis. I'm Eileen Pullen. And I worked for Ford's Motor Company making seats. I worked for Ford's Motor Company as a sewing machinist. With the grading system at Ford's, it was A, unskilled, B, semi-skilled, and C, was skilled. They classed us as unskilled, but in their minds, we were skilled. And of course, men working on skilled work had a much higher rate of pay than we did because we were classed as unskilled. We'd been putting our claims in every year when the wage claims come in, but they just turned us down. Fords didn't want to pay women the skilled wage. They didn't think we was worth it. We were so fed up of being treated as a second-class citizen. We had the meeting in the car park and we decided we've had enough. If we want to do something about it, we've got to walk out. We all put our hands up to say we strike. We went back to our machines, picked up our bags and walked out. The supervision said, well, where are you all going? What did you say? Home. We were nervous, but we were determined and nothing was going to stop us from doing it. We had two runs to the House of Commons. There was a coach load of us, 52. We just walked up in front of the Parliament with our banners. We had to accept the percentage. It was disappointing because you, you didn't get what you wanted, but it was a bit more than what we was getting. But it took us another 16 to 18 years to get the equal pay with the men that we were working with. The skill grade, that was our fight. The skill grade to be recognised. We didn't expect it to come to that, you know, because it was just for ourselves, really. I didn't feel proud at the time, but I do feel proud now. It was so wonderful when it, you know, everybody got it. When all women got it, it was so wonderful. What would your advice be to women now? Well, fight for it. If you think you're entitled to it, go for it. you just got to keep fighting. If you feel that you're not being treated properly, you have got to fight for yourself. Go for it, girl.